A possible ceasefire deal between Israel and Hamas could be in the works, and the chief U.S. diplomat says it's on Hamas to accept it. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken spoke at the Sedona Forum last night, a gathering hosted by the McCain Institute in Sedona, Arizona. Blinken talked about his recent Middle East trip and rumors that serious negotiations are underway of a ceasefire and hostage release proposal on the table between Israel and Hamas. The secretary says the time is now for a deal, but it would be on the shoulders of Hamas if it's rejected. In this moment, the best thing that can happen would be for the agreement that's on the table that's being considered by Hamas to have a ceasefire, the release of hostages, uh, the possibility of really surging humanitarian assistance to people who so desperately need it. That's what we're focused on. We await a response from Hamas. Uh, we await to see whether, in effect, they can take yes for an answer on the ceasefire and release of hostages. The Associated Press says reaching a deal could delay or halt Israel's plans to invade Rafah in southern Gaza. Blinken also says a deal could then lead to normalizing relations with Arab neighbors like Saudi Arabia.